This is the MX2 Jaguar ETM. And it actually, it's a model that actually will follow the Jaguar, popular Jaguar 8.4 ETM. We recognize that many operators are running this system from their vans and running it actually up to 200 feet. But I'd like to point out with this model several added features. The first thing we're going to point out will be the vacuum motors. MX2 means maximum extraction performance with two 8.4 vacuum motors. And the two also represents the dual stage, not single stage, dual stage, and that's very, very important. Um, we work closely with Amatech to further develop these popular motors to upgrade so that they will take on higher heat temperatures. In other words, a lot of operators we found were putting this in their vans, congested vans, and they either had their, their generators exhausting directly on the machine or they had it congested with their hose reels and everything else. <clears throat> it's important that we have exterior cool air come in. Now again, we work closely with Amatech regarding this and they appreciated how we mount the vac motors. Here we have an air separator. That draws in cool air from the outside directly to the motor. Also in the back, we draw in cool air directly to that motor. Again, we don't mount them uh, right side up within a base because if you mount them right side up, they're going to have a tendency to draw in that heat. Now, let's move on to the pump. The pump is mounted in the middle. It's a gold-headed pump. Now you see where we mount it, this is strategic because the placement allows even weight distribution. That's important again when you're in your van because when you're turning corners it's less likely to tip over and with that weight distribution vibration is important and so on. But this is a quad cell pump that provides up to 800 PSI, it's absolutely the best one made in the industry and very, very proven. You'll notice that it has two capacitors. One capacitor is for starting, and then the other one takes over and that's for running. The purpose between the dual is that it helps lower your amp draw so you're less likely to trip breakers. Let's move on to the back where the, we have the pump-out pump. This is an on-demand pump-out pump. Thing interesting here is that if somebody would drive over your discharge hose, say for example, uh, it will automatically shut that down. In other words, you're not gonna have back pressure on that pump uh, or bursting hoses. The other feature I really like is that it's a 3.5 gallon per minute pump, and if you wanna replace it, it's really neat. You could, you've got these tabs, you pull up, you easily pull out or you push those back in and you're all set to go. Let's move on to the hoses. The hoses are all, all have quick disconnect swivels on them. In other words, they're very easy to unswivel, take off. It's a Terra Glide hose. They're rated at 3250 PSI. So to be honest, you will never replace those hoses. They're permanent hoses. The other thing is that we have a wiring harness along the side. Coming off the wiring harness at their four respective locations, you have wiring quick disconnects and they're all color coded. So that's for easy replacement by an operator. We also provide protection behind the switches uh, for water protection or what have you and everything is behind the protection. Here is your regulator off the side, protected on the side and let's move to the wheels. The rear wheel is a semi pneumatic wheel. Easy spinning, it rolls over just about any kind of terrain you might roll over. It's just under three inches wide. It's the widest one in the industry. 
And being semi-pneumatic, the reason for that is that it will take, uh, give you less vibration in your truck from your equipment running. Uh, when you're bouncing over uneven roads, it takes that force and it also helps stabilize the machine when you turn corners and so on. But they're very quiet, they're the best in the industry. You got a mag hub, and this is interesting. If you wanna take the wheel off for any kind of service, you've got this special cap on the end. You pull it off, or you wanna reinstall, you just simply push it on and it locks in the position. In the front, we have swivel casters. These are dual bearing casters, so they're easy turning, and also they're easy to grease. You got a greaser here on the side, and we recommend maybe once every six, eight months, you might uh, shoot some grease in there to, to uh, have that roll easily. And there you have it. There's your MX-2 Jaguar ETM. It's a real workhorse, you're gonna love it. Thank you.